welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I will gonna show how to install and configure Samba server in Kali Linux. So first of all, we have to install the Samba server using this command. I gave all commands in the descriptions. So now we have to edit the smb.conf configuration file. Open the file with your favorite text editor. I am using here Nano text editor. You can read the documentation if you want. Now the end of the file you have to enter these lines. Name you to want to show. Path of the shared directory. Browsable is yes, and read only is no. Now save the file using Ctrl plus O, and for exit press the Ctrl plus X. Now we have to create the shared directory using this command. Now I am creating a simple file in the shared folder for sharing with Windows. Now we have to change the access permissions of shared directory using this command. Now start the Samba services using this command. Now you can see the command execute without any error. That means our Samba server configured. Now you can check the status using this command. And status is active and running without any error. Now we have to set the Samba server's password using this command. You can use existing user account or create new one for this. Enter the new SMB password and then verify the new password. User is added in the Samba server. Now using this command we can check our IP address. Copy the IP address. Now I am switching my OS. So in Windows 10 I am check the IP address, the Windows 10 system on same network or not. So you can verify using ping command and you can see the ping reply. Now open the run using Win plus R key and type the IP address like this. Now here we have to enter the username and password of the Samba server. Now you can see the sharing name which is mentioned in the smb.conf file. And this is the file which is created by me. Now I am making some changes in this file. So I open this file and edit a new line. And now save the file in Windows 10. So now I am going to Kali Linux. And here we can check the file using cat command and verify the changes. So that is it. This is the way how to install and configure Samba server in Kali Linux. Thank you for watching this video. And make sure to subscribe my channel so you don't miss out on my future videos. Thank you very much. See you in next video.